Hey, it's Dory. So today I'm going to be making holiday treats, Halloween treats for my dog and my daughter using these cookie cutters that I got from Seria. And Seria is like a 100 yen store in Japan. And lately they've been selling a lot of Halloween and Christmas stuff. So I got this and I thought I would make some dog treats and some healthy treats for my daughter. Let's get started. Okay, so these treats are gonna be pretty plain because I'm going to be giving them to my dog as well. So these are the ingredients. It's very healthy and also dog friendly. I have oatmeal, organic applesauce with no sugar added, pumpkin. So I couldn't find pumpkin puree, so I'm using this instead. Um, it's already packaged into bite-sized pieces, so I'm just gonna microwave it, but it's like, smushed pumpkin, mashed pumpkin. Uh, I have cinnamon for a little bit of flavor and an egg. So let's get started. I'm going to microwave the mashed pumpkin. I used five cubes, which is around 65 grams. While that's heating up, I'm going to grind one cup of oatmeal to make oat flour. In a bigger bowl, I'm going to add the oat flour and the heated pumpkin. Next, I'm going to whisk up one egg and add that in as well. Afterwards, I'm going to add in the applesauce. And for the final touch, I'm going to add in the cinnamon and mix everything together. So now the dough looks done. Let's use the cookie cutters and cut out the cookies. And with the leftover dough, I'm going to make squares since it's a lot faster. The cookies have a cute shape, but it's a little bit lacking, so let me try writing a face. Oh, they're so cute! All done! Now let me pop these in the oven. I've set it for 180 degrees Celsius and for 10 minutes. I hope it turns out good. Ooh, all done. Let me cool it down and do a taste test. Okay, so I'm all done. Uh, while the cute ones are cooling down, I have the jack-o'-lantern and the ghost. And they turned out so cute with the faces. <laughs> I'm so happy. I don't bake a lot, so this is an uh, achievement for me. Anyways, let me cool these down and uh, taste test the squares. So they're still a little hot. Hmm. And they're soft on the inside right now. It might harden when it cools down, but... Mm. To be honest, they don't really have that much flavor. <laughs> There's like a hint of apple and cinnamon, but I can't really taste the pumpkin. I can taste the oats though, so... Basically, it tastes like oatmeal with a little bit of apple and a little bit of cinnamon. But they're healthy, so it'll make good treats for my dog and my daughter. So now let me give one to my dog, Cooper. Uh, should I give him the cute one or the squares? I think I'm going to save the cute ones for my daughter, but I'll give these to Cooper. Let's go! Cooper, would you like a treat? Say trick or treat. Okay, okay. Sit. Sit down. Good. Oh, that. So, we will give you a treat now. Okay, wait. 
It might be hot. Okay. Mmm. How is it? Is it good? Oh, it's good. It's good. Oh, he likes it. Yay. Do you want more? Do you want more? Oh. Yes. Okay, one sec. Okay, this is the last one. Last one for the day. Okay, what the? Oh, you're already giving me your hand. Okay, let's divide it into two. Okay, and here you go. Yum. Oh. <laughs> you like it. I'm so happy. Is it delicious? Mmm. So now I'm going to give one to my daughter. Do you want the pumpkin or the ghost? Aren't they cute? The pumpkin? <laughs> you don't like it? Okay, let me cut them for you. Here you go. <laughs> you don't like it? Oh. Okay, let's give this to daddy. Papa, papa ni agete. Papa ni agete. Hi. Cookie to your pan to your Oh. It's not it's... cookie. It's like a bread. <laughs> okay, thank you. So I made these for Halloween because I got the cute cookie cutters, but you can make them for any occasion and they're healthy. So they're great for your kids or your pets, your pet dog. So thank you for watching. Happy Halloween and happy holidays. I hope you enjoyed the video and see you in the next one. Bye.